hello they are welcome back to another new video so today we are going to do something uh else like i always do like custom rom reviews for my redmi note 8 so today i'm going to do it for my mi 4 so if you are looking at my channel and if you have looked my previous videos you, you may have seen this phone mi 4 so i bought this phone actually to flash windows 10 mobile on it but because it is a different model not lte model of which support windows 10 so i couldn't able to do that but after that i tried many custom rom on it so there are a lot of custom rom available but today's one is interesting one so today we are going to do it on selfish os so selfish os is based on actually migo which is one of my favorite uh, os which is only can be found on nokia and nine and any other device don't come with migo os so this selfish os is based on migo os so let me show you what's going on with this device so this device is this rom is actually fully based on gesture so there is no use of these buttons and other things so you can do it all with the gesture so in the home screen you will see like your uh, running application so these are the application and these are live actually so as you can see the time and date are live now 360 pm and as you can see 316 so it's it's live and one of the thing is that this rom is like this selfish voice is quite actually interesting but it's really difficult to use and it has actually a major problem also although it's a quite good rom but it has major problem not like uh, the phone problem or the the OS but the, the entire OS has problem so currently uh, for my this device it's working and I haven't uh, used selfish OS before and I tried to flash it on my readme uh, note 4 actually and i was not successful that time but this time around for my mi 4 i i am successful now i'm using it and it's quite interesting actually this rom is quite interesting first of all let's go and show you which version so the version i'm using it now as you can see your selfish os 3.0 it this is an outdated version maybe from 2019 so there is no updated version of it and as for this build everything working fine like wi-fi bluetooth and your camera audio and everything is working fine uh, but there is no updated version of it why you need to install this uh, os i will explain it later on so for this and the battery backup is actually quite good on this rom because not much thing actually running in the background because there is no google application or it's not an android actually it's completely different os so to go your home screen you can uh, drag from here directly from the corner and it will go to the home screen but if you go to the like previous button like to go to the uh back so you have to just uh do the gesture from like this and let me show you so we go to the home screen again so here and if i go to the setting if i go to developer option so if you want to go back just swipe then it will go back and if you go entirely from here it will go directly to the home screen and this button doesn't work only the back button will work actually so if i go here the press the back button it will work but home is uh, the home button and menu button has no function in this rom and uh, aesthetic wise it's quite look like actually android but it's totally different if i go to the setting menu so if, if we are in setting menu as you can see here it's totally different thing and it looks beautiful actually um but it's a little bit um you have to be used to of it used to use this rom because it's quite uh like windows mobile so the things are not in the same place as you can find on android rom so here as you can see everything are there like you can device log and other things and selfish OS update i have already tried it you will not get any update and language and select text input you cannot change any keyboard actually so the built-in keyboard is there so there is no third party keyboard option maybe maybe there but i couldn't able to find so it's not working for me so if i go here now the best part is application part what application can you use in this rom in this rom so if i go here in the uh, application menu so there are a lot of applications as you can see uh, some of the application i have installed are the file browser and cute spot which is a client of spotify uh jboy is a emulation then you and player is a music player friends is for facebook and there is something for twitter also so the browser here is, is outdated already there is the, the browser doesn't load pages properly right now 
it does work but it does not load page properly so we have store here let me connect to the wi-fi first it's coming with zola store and if you want to use zola store so this is as you can see zola if you want to use zola store you have to create an account zola account it's quite easy you just put your email address and you it, you choose your user name and it will be there so the application here are very less not more than hundred thousand maybe not even ten thousand maybe not i'm i'm saying it a bit too much maybe ten thousand and there is not much useful game or useful things so as you can see here we have twitter but i'm uh, i haven't tried anything here like logging in facebook and other things because i don't really trust because it's already outdated rom so i don't really trust to put my maybe because i don't have really fake ids and so I, I don't want to create another one to try here yeah? just it, it's it's there so if you want to try it you can try it and these are some applications here as you can see not much actually and there is not much useful application also there so for the application part you just leave it there you you can't do anything about it so if i go here as you can see the the, the stack the minimize app here and there is and this side you will get all the information of your notification and other things comes this side like me go and this side also same left side and right side if i go here like it's come with like some of the application these are the application which are pre-installed and you have ir con remotes for your meme but one thing is that the camera is working properly actually so if i show you here camera does work but it a bit slow the application on this phone works but uh, it takes time to open so whenever you or try to open application it will go your home screen and it will open it and it takes time a bit a bit time so and it does work on everything like you can do messaging and calling and everything does work and other things like you can play games like emulation games so i have super mario as you can see here i just put it to play and if i start here so it does work maybe let's go i don't really know how to play this game because i have never played this game but there are a lot of game boy games option just download the rom and put it in the folder it will work Maybe sometime you will see crash because I don't really play games, so I don't know about that. I haven't tried it. But rather than that, like if I as I'm saying that the, the, the browser is outdated, so if I go to the YouTube option, why? Okay, let's go to the YouTube. Maybe YouTube will work, but Facebook and other things you will see that the browser version is like outdated. They will say it. So let's try. Okay, I can't even touch okay the, the, the problem with this thing actually is not the ROM problem it's the touch screen problem of this device it has uh, uh, the res responseness of touch is not that good on this ROM so the YouTube is working actually so as you can see let me try to open a video let's try it can load the video or not uh, it's take time actually Although the, the 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 internet connection is quite good in my room, actually it's not bad. So it, it's taking time actually a lot. Maybe because of outdated browser, it takes time. But may, may but one thing is that maybe it will work. The videos will work here. But there is no YouTube application. You have to, if you want to watch videos, you have to go to like this this browser option only, and. Uh, it's take time but it will may, maybe work or may not work so who is this rom for so if you are looking for like security if you don't want google application and other things you just want a simple phone and if you have laying around this phone and you want to try so as you can see here that the application is working now in the background so i go here it does work but the, the application is still working now so the, the as you can see here maybe if i push now yes it's working so the, the application is working so so it's not not like the rom has some issue because it's already outdated and and all the 
application which I have been emails are there and so as I'm talking about the who is this ROM for so if you have lying around this phone you just want to use selfish OS or something different than your uh, ROM like Windows phone or your Apple iPhone or or your Android so if you want to try something else like uh, you want to experience something new you can try this ROM if your phone is laying around just you keeping it and you can use this phone as your like for your call and messaging and listening to the music rather than that you will not be able to do anything else but you can snap photos and videos maybe no one will take uh, photos and videos with this phone right now it's quite old maybe about maybe eight years so that's it for the selfish OS. and one interesting thing about this rom is that so uh, i have tried many roms on this phone before uh, like android 10 android 11 and other things but i never got like double tap to wake up features on any other roms but this rom comes with it and i don't know how to open it or you know, it's just built in there so if i double tap it uh, awake the screen so it works actually but i couldn't able to find it on even in the uh, official miui rom also i couldn't able to find so that's it for this rom like selfish os 3.0 and selfish os 4.0 may support like some of the android apps if you install the official version only so but i i have no idea how to get them because it's it, there is no no way to get it so that's it for today thank you very much for watching and i will see you next time